Right, so it's your boy Alfie. I'm back again today. Um, we've got some Shining Fates tins to open. There's five of them. Um, there's two packs in each tin. I think there's a coin as well in each tin. I'm not 100% sure. Um, what I'll do is um, we'll just go a tin at a time and we'll see what we get. I think these might be quite difficult. Oh, they might not be too hard. Let's have a look. One second. Ah. Right. So that's first tin, let's see what we get. So we've got a, a coin. We've got a rush round card. And we've got two card packs, which is stuck right in the back. Right, that's the first one down. So we'll open these and we'll see what we get. Card. Right, so we've got Water Energy to start us off. Got Gym Trainer, got Rusty's Sword, got Cramorant, got Chewtel, got Cacne, got Gossiflua, got Coffin, got Morpeko, got a Zerud, and got a Zerud again. So two Zeruds in one pack, love that. Right, next pack is a Toxtricity pack. Um, I'm really just wanting baby shinies out of these, so... Um, that's what I'm after, so we'll see what we can get. Right, so we've got a Dark Energy, a Gym Trainer, an Eldegoss, Dark Tricks, Yammer, Tutel, Kufant, Horsa, Cacne, Tropius, Oh, look at that now, Creamy V for that. It's a great pull. So we're two packs in. That's the best pull I've had for a, a while in Shiny Fates. And, right, so now we're onto the Zerud tin. If you've opened these tins before yourself, let me know what you, if you've had up decent out of them. They were um, on offer, I think, so five tins for £45. Um, Pound sterling that is, so I thought it was a good value. Got a Mewtwo coin. Got a Zerud artwork. You know what I said about Charizard packs, don't they? You don't get up good in them. Right, so that's that tin complete. Right, we'll go with Carvernite pack first. So that's the cut. Right. So we've got Metal Energy, Fuwake, Gym Trainer, Luxia, Horse, Shinx, Spinarak, Grooke, Snom, Shinx Reverse, and a Frost Moth. Well, I suppose it's something getting a hollow rather than getting um, just a rare card in the back. So, the Charizard pack. Let's see if we can get some luck in the Charizard pack. It doesn't normally happen. I'm going to say that now. It doesn't normally happen. Right, so we've got a Water Energy, a Cramorant, a Eldegoss. Rusted Shield, a Trap Inch, a Grooke, a Shinx, a Coffin, a Boizo, a Yvelta, a Yvelta, and a Cramoran. So it's not been a bad pack, actually, that one. Um, it's always nice getting an amazing rare. And the Cramoran is obviously a better than standard pull getting a V. Uh, just one minute, I'm just going to put these in this side because I'm. We're running out of space. Also, guys, what does everyone do with, like, you know, the spare power like that? I mean, you could only collect so many, like, you know, in your set. So what do you do with your extra cards, your excess? Right, so this is the next one. We're on to the mutant now. And this is tightly packed, so I can't even grip it. It's always, always good. Always good when the fight means something good in there. 
Right, so we've got, uh, is that a Manfi? I don't know, Manfi coin, I think. So that's a Celebi. He's two foot tall. It's quite big, actually. I didn't think he was that big, Celebi. I thought it was only small. Right, so that's a Celebi tin out of the way. What, I've just dropped and thrown it. All the coins everywhere, but never mind. Right, so we'll do it again. We've got Covenant and a Charizard pack, so we'll go with a Covenant pack. That's your code card. So you've got one, two, three, and four. Right, so we've got a Metal Energy, Flacke, Ball Guy, Tropius, Morpeko, Shootle, Routlet, Trapinch. Coughing, an Orbe, oh, nice, shiny, and a Professor of Research, which, you know, my feelings on getting supporters in the rare slot, it's not great. Actually, that can stand up, because that's a, I suppose that's a good one as well. So, to be fair, all the tins so far have been decent. Um, in my opinion, anyway, I mean, I don't know what you guys think, what you, you expect from these cards, from these packs. Um, I don't think that's too bad. Maybe it's because I've been opening recently, like Champions Path and stuff like that, and there's just nothing in them. It's really difficult to get a good pull. It's got Water Energy, Rusted Shield, Rotom, Team Your Towel, Shinx, Spinarak, Boisel, Kufant, Cacne, a Rookie D. That's nice. Deluxe Array. So two. Pulls in this pack. It's a bit, um, I don't know if you can see it on there, if you're picking it up. It's a bit like um, the shinies coming out of the side, if you know what I mean. It's a bit, I can't really call it. Um, but yeah. Not the best in that case, but. Right, so I'll just throw that on that pile because that's not, not special. Right, so we've got the Manfa tin next. Trying to um, open these with my teeth, They're that hard to open. Um, right, so it's got another Manfa coin. Got the Manfa, which is is one foot tall. The Manfa, three point one pounds. It's very light. Right, so let's put that to the side. As a carbonite then. That's the code. Right, so we've got Dark Energy, Dark Tricks, Brewster's Shield, Cramorant, Coughing, Morpeko, Chuto, Routlet, Trapinch, got a Shinx, Reverse, and a Morpeko VMAX. Again, not a bad pull. Anything V up really is um, which class is decent. I mean, I have got the Morpeko pretty much completed the basic part of this set. It's just the um, uh, the shiny is really what I need at the back, the baby shinies and stuff. Well, let's see what we get. Right, so we've got a Dark Energy. An Eldegoss, get a Team Your Towel, got Rusty Shield, a Spinarak, got more Pekka, got Grooke, Horse, Coughing, got Cramorant Reverse, and a Dredna. Dredna Rare. Right, so again, these tins aren't bad. You think I've opened four tins? I don't think that's bad pulls at all, really. I mean, yeah, it's not bad. If I'd, if I'd opened uh, Shiny Fates ETB and I'd pulled that, all them cards out of Shiny Fates ETB, I'd be like, wow, what a great ETB it's been. Don't know why that Shink's got up there. That Shink should have been at the back. It was your crammer on. So, yeah, we've got six pulls so far. Uh, four tins. I can't... Yeah, I'm still trying to open this tin. It's like 
really well sealed. This Kyogre's really, really protecting the tin. It's got Manfi again. Kyogre. Right, so these are the two last packs of this opening. So we're open for just baby shinies, really. Let's go. That's the code. Right, so we've got Fighting Energy, Eldegoss, Dark Tricks, Ball Guy, Coughing. Yamma, Trap Inch, Grookey D, Rooster Show Reverse, and a Ball Canyon. Right, so it would be nice to get something out of this last pack, um, but we'll see. So that's the Coca. Right, so we've got uh, Electric Energy, Floatzel, Luxio, Team Yell Towel, Horsey, Mikit, Eva, Chuto, Cacne, Eva Reverse, and there's a Rude. Right, so the last tin just didn't give us up really. Um, right. So as you can see in front, these were the big pulls. I'm not going to go through the reverses because everyone's seen them. We've got a uh, Mopeko VMAX, a Cramorant. We've got now Creamy V, which, yeah, that's a great pull. Uh, Rookie Day, which has got a bit of... You can see the shiny coming through the edge. You've got um, your Velta, or y Veltal, or whatever. I don't even know how you pronounce that. It gets me every time. Your Veltal, your Velta, I don't know, y Veltal. I've got an Albito. Right, if you enjoyed that, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you stuck around till this point, that's the final co-card. Peace out.